Now, there's an earlier choice for late local news. This is Q13 Fox News at 9 on MyQ2. Only on Q13 Fox News tonight, they came for coffee but got quite a show. And a camera catches a local bikini barista bearing it all. The lewd behavior launched a police investigation. Now five local women are facing prostitution charges. Let's get right to Q13 Fox News reporter James Lynch, who has been following this story all day, James. Unbelievable, Maria. This is the culmination of a two-month investigation by the Everett Police Department. They probably don't know it yet because the filings came late this evening, but five grab-and-go baristas working within the city of Everett are now charged with multiple counts of prostitution and multiple violations of the city's adult entertainment ordinance. It was behavior like this, witnessed by Everett investigators, that led to today's charges. Police say it happened here at the Grab and Go Bikini Coffee Hut in the 8,000 block of Broadway. As we watched this evening, cars, one after another, pulled in and pulled out. Neighbors say traffic here lasts all day and all night. We shot this video from a nearby home, and the homeowner says she's been shocked at what she sees. She chose not to go on camera. They have spread their underwear into their shots. The video you see here was shot at a different grab-and-go bikini hut on Highway 99 in Snohomish County just outside Everett. None of the girls here have been charged, but this video shows the conduct with some of them is the same. After the driver ordered coffee and paid, the barista held up the change, about $16, and asked if he wanted something extra. When he asked what, she says, a flash and proceeded to drop her bottoms, flash her vagina, then turn around, spread her cheeks, and flash her rear. Then she turned around again and flashed her vagina. For extra money, these women would expose um, their entire body. They would take, if they were wearing a bikini, they would uh, either take it off or, or at least lower it. Uh, they, uh, there were some allegations, complaints from our citizens that that they were performing whipped cream shows between two, two of the women. As for the prostitution charges, police say there doesn't appear to have been actual intercourse. Instead, the sexual conduct, as defined by the Everett Municipal Code, included any touching of the sexual and other intimate parts of a person. This woman, who again was not charged, says not all of the baristas break the law. Girls want to do what they want to do, and they 